हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल इंजीनियर्स एकेडमी काइंडली सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल इफ़ यू हैवेंट सब्सक्राइब इट येट नाउ लेट्स सॉल्व दिस पर्टिकुलर प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम चैप्टर थर्टीन इन दिस प्रॉब्लम इट इज सेट दैट सिलेंडर बी हैज़ अ मास एम एंड इज हॉइस्टेड यूजिंग द कार्ड एंड पुलिस सिस्टम शोन डिटरमाइन द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ फोर्स एफ इज अ फंक्शन ऑफ द ब्लॉक्स वर्टिकल पोजिशन वाई सो वी हैव टू फाइंड एफ एज अ फंक्शन ऑफ वाई so that when f is applied the block rises with a constant acceleration ab and further it is said that neglect the mass of the card and the pulleys right so first of all i will find if i if i draw a horizontal line here so let's say that this rope and this rope they are making theta angle with the vertical let's say that these angles are thetas right so now if these angles are equal right this cylinder this pulley will maintain the midpoint of this d right so then this means that this length from here to here this length will be d divided by 2 and this is y right so we can find this hypotenuse right so we can write that the hypotenuse by applying the pythagoras theorem the hypotenuse will be equal to uh, this y square plus this d by 2 square right so i will write d divided by 2 square so if i simplify this so this will be y square plus d square divided by 4 so this is the hypotenuse right now if i consider the free body diagram of uh, this cylinder right so we have to isolate it right so so this will be the same force f which is applied here right since right, right since it's a continuous cable so we will have that same force f here and we will have that same force f here as well right and the weight of this cylinder will be acting vertically downward and it will be equal to mg right and this cylinder is going up with an acceleration of ab right so this is our positive x and y coordinate system so now if i apply the equation of kinetics that is the summation of forces along y equals to m a y and the acceleration in the y direction is equal to ab right so now as we can see that if we resolve this force f into its component so it will have one component will be acting in this direction and it will have one component in this direction and similarly this force f will have one another component will be acting vertically upward and it will have one component will be acting in this direction so these two are the cos components right so if i add up the forces in the y direction so this is our positive y direction so this will be 2f cos of theta this one is f cos of theta so f cos of theta plus f cos of theta will give us 2f cos of theta right so 2f cos of theta minus Minus this weight, which is acting in the negative y direction, so I have to subtract it. So this will be min, uh, minus mg, and this will be equal to m a y, and a y is equal to a b, right? So this is that a b. So now we can write this equation as 2 f cos of theta equals to m a b minus mg, and we can take m as common as well, right? So this will be a b minus. This will become plus, right? So this will be mab plus mg right this will become positive on the other side of equation and then we can take m common right so we will have the equation like this and now if i divide both sides of the equation by 2 cos of theta so we will get that force f right so this will be m ab plus g divided by 2 cos of theta we can find cos of theta by using this triangle right we have a triangle like this this is d divided by 2 this is y and this is the hypotenuse which is y square plus d square divided by 4 under the square root so uh, this is theta so we can find cos of theta so cos of theta will be equal to base so base is y and the hypotenuse is this right so this is y square plus d square divided by 4 So now I can substitute this cos of theta in this equation, right? So this will be f 
एम ए बी प्लस जी डिवाइडेड बाई टू कॉज ऑफ थीटा राइट सो कॉज ऑफ थीटा इज वाई डिवाइडेड बाई वाई स्क्वेयर प्लस डी स्क्वेयर डिवाइडेड बाई फोर एंड हेयर वी हैव दैट स्क्वेयर रूट एज वेल राइट और वी कैन राइट दिस इन इन दिस फॉर्म एज वेल सो दिस विल बी ए बी प्लस जी दिस विल कम टू द न्यूमिरेटर राइट सो वी विल हैव वाई स्क्वेयर प्लस डी स्क्वेयर डिवाइड बाई फोर under the square root divided by 2y right so this is the force f as a function of y that vertical distance right so this is the solution of this particular problem i hope you people would have understood this uh, kindly like this video if you people want me to solve such more problems also subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed it yet